So this dashboard is showing all the cases we've managed inside Salesforce. And as you can see, it goes back many years, but the vast majority of these cases are closed and we no longer use them. And yet they continue to surface in the UI and they get in our way. And the question is, how do I archive this historic data? Now there are a few different ways to do this, but in my case, I chose to use big objects. So big objects are built for massive scale, billions of records. And here I've defined a new cases big object to store my old cases. But once this big object is defined, how do I get my old cases into it? Well, to do this, I've embedded this custom lightning web component here inside the case record. And when I click this button, it copies the current case into big object storage, then it deletes the case. And if I wanted to retrieve it later, I would navigate to the parent account and use another custom component to retrieve any related archived cases. And that's the basic idea. Move old cases into big object storage, then use the API to retrieve those old cases as needed. But I didn't wanna archive cases one by one. Instead, I wanted to do it in mass. So I created this utility, and I can use this utility to relocate all cases older than a certain date. Now this is typically something I would schedule to execute in the background, but for demo purposes, I've added it here to the UI. And what you're seeing here are thousands and thousands of cases being relocated into big object storage. And now it's finished, and I can refresh to see all the new archived cases, which means if I return to the original dashboard and refresh it, you'll see all those old cases are now gone. And I've now effectively cleansed our data. But I know what you might be thinking at this point. What if I wanted to report on this archived data? It's possible, but to do it, I need to extract a subset of this data for reporting purposes. So let's do that. So this is Workbench and I can use it to interact with the big object API. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to paste a bit of JSON. Now this JSON contains a query which counts the case totals for each year. And then these query results will be loaded into this custom object. And when this gets finished, this is what it looks like. This is just a small subset of the big object data. And I can now report on this data, which is how I created this dashboard. This dashboard contains reporting on archive data sitting side by side with reporting on active case data. And that's how big objects can be used to archive Salesforce data.